County Commissioner says making it more difficult and expensive to get bullets is really a way to make the streets safer, and he says his own experiences are living proof. In a deeply personal and powerful press conference today, Wayne County Commissioner Reggie Davis says we all need to aim for a safer community. This is Vito. So this is the Davis family right here. The loss of his younger brother Vito in 2001 to gun violence has prompted this local leader to propose a limit to the purchase of ammunition in Wayne County. He also wants ammo to be purchased from law enforcement agencies and to require a check of a buyer's mental background. We are prepared to fight all the way. Ultimately, uh, in my brother Vito's name and my uncle Ricky, uh, who are here, uh, who died as a result of gun violence. Known as the bullet bill, Davis is lobbying for additional county taxes to cover administrative fees. Here at Woodlawn Cemetery, he's chosen to spread a message that our streets cannot continue to be what he calls killing fields. Yet Davis admits his crusade will require support from other leaders. State legislators, uh, you know, Congress uh, persons, it's your duty to now step forward, team up with us, and make this come to become reality. While it's still just a proposal, Davis hopes that if this bill were to become law, some of the money from additional taxes would go towards education and assisting the families victimized by gun violence. Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News. Thank you, Simon.